All right, guys, so it's currently 3.20 a.m. I'm super tired, about to pass out, but I just had to make sure I got this video out first because I am so happy right now, guys. I mean, I really wasn't expecting this. I kind of saw it coming. I thought maybe we would get it too, but I wasn't expecting it at all, you know? And now it's officially been confirmed. Global is going to be getting the new uh, Fighting Legend Goku GT Edition or GT Legendary Goku event for, uh, I guess, kind of a part two to the celebration. I don't know if it's going to be officially called part two or just like a continuation of the celebration. Either way, either way, it's coming. Okay, you see the promo, you see the news, a new challenge event coming soon. Fighting Legend Goku GT Edition will soon be available. Goku, who possesses power on par with that of opponents from the extremely challenging event Extreme Super Battle Road, will show up in this event, strengthen your team, and get prepared for this upcoming event. And uh, that's pretty much it. They don't give us a date. They never really do with these promos, but I would assume it's going to be within the next... Uh, week probably less than that probably like three to four days at most and i can't wait i can't wait it's coming guys both global and jp are going to be getting this event um the reason of course i thought that maybe global wouldn't get it is because obviously we were missing a few things from the jp celebration um specifically things like the lrb pen extreme z awakening a bunch of other awakenings and um you know, I just thought maybe they would leave this one out too, but nah, man, it's on the way. It's coming. I'm, I'm stoked. I'm stoked. And uh, as much as you know, you want to complain about certain injustices that were committed upon Global, this is definitely a big win for us. This is a big dub. Um, you know, this is just a great moment to be a Global player, and uh, I'll take what I can get, man. I'll take what I can get. Um, I might seem a little bit delirious right now because I honestly am. Like, it's been a long day. It's, once again, 3.25 a.m. So I really should be in bed. But I just I just couldn't go to bed, you know, with this news and not just, like, share my excitement for it with you guys. I'm sure a lot of you guys feel the same. Uh, maybe you guys saw it coming. Maybe you're not as stoked or not as, like, surprised because you were like, I knew this was going to be a thing. That's cool. Uh, regardless, it's on the way, and uh, in terms of, you know, the enemies and stuff like that, I mean, obviously it's going to be all Gokus from GT, uh, from base form all the way up to, you know, Super Saiyan 4, Super Saiyan uh, Full Power Super Saiyan 4, or what's the actual name? Super Full Power Saiyan 4 Goku, right? And I'm assuming 7 to 8 stages, um, you know, kind of the same deal, but hopefully just harder, right? Like right now we have... Uh, let's see, I have it prepared here. We have the base Goku all the way to uh, Mastered Ultra Instinct Goku, right? And even though when it first came out, it was fairly challenging, right? Like a lot of people had trouble with it. Once people figured out like how to deal with these longer events, um, it really wasn't too bad, you know what I mean? So at this point, the original Legendary Goku event for like end game players, for long term players, not so much of a challenge. Hopefully this new one is more of a challenge, right? Like, um, I don't want to be, I don't want it to be so hard where like most of the player base or like, you know, 80% of the player base can't beat it. But obviously I just want more of a challenge. I want something that's going to make me, you know, think about the teams I bring, make me think about, you know, oh, like who should I put in front of these attacks and like just use more strategy, I guess, right? That's always a good thing, I think, in this game. And, uh... Yeah, that's kind of what I'm expecting. I mean, they, they did say it, right? As hard as Extreme Super Battle Road. So, uh, hopefully they live up to that. I mean, it depends on which stage of Extreme Super Battle Road, right? Because obviously, like, there are a lot more difficult stages compared to, like, some other stages that are, like, less difficult. But uh, either way, I like the sound of that. I'm, you know, very excited. Once again, as I've said many times in this video, for this to come out and uh you know it's another event that's gonna allow us to 
put those stacking units to use, right? And also test out our new units, because obviously, like, all the new units these days are getting more and more OP, right? So we need more and more challenging events to take them on to really get the most out of them. So yeah, that's gonna be fun. And of course, more stones are on the way from the missions, I'm assuming. Uh, they might do the same thing as the current LG where we get, uh, you know, some like missions for different categories used to, to beat, the, beat the event. And also hopefully a new Goku banner. You know how like there's the ticket banner for the legendary Goku event where it's all Gokus. I'm hoping that this time they'll give us an updated banner with like better Gokus featured, but also with um, you know more of the Goku LRs, right? Like a uh, Spirit Bomb absorbed Goku, and uh, what's the other one that we're missing? Uh, the LR God Coup. Yeah, LR God Coup as well. Um, I think Super Saiyan 3 Goku. Yeah, Super Saiyan 3 Goku is definitely on the uh, previous banner, so he'll be there for sure. And are there any other standalone Gokus I'm missing? I feel like I am. Like LRs, I mean, um, that I'm not thinking about. There must be one more. Maybe not. Maybe there's not a lot of standalone LR Gokus in this game. Either way. Oh, oh. Of course, how can I forget? UI Goku. Yeah, UI Goku. I can't believe that's the one that I forgot. So yeah, hopefully it has UI Goku on it. Um, you know, Spirit Bomb Absorb Goku, and also uh, God Coup on that ticket banner. That'd be pretty sweet, in my opinion. And we're still waiting for that legendary Vegeta event, obviously, like that's gotta be a thing at some point, but uh, let's not get let's not get too greedy right now, you know. Like let's like just enjoy this event for uh, all Dokkan players. Once again, global and JP. Hopefully sooner than later. I'm gonna say within like yeah three to four days it'll come out. The boy will be doing a stream for it, of course. Hopefully get my ass kicked a couple times, right? Like I want to get beat down a couple times before I can beat it, because. That's gonna be more fun than just like cruising through it like most events of the game. But uh, yeah, guys, that's all I gotta say. I just had to let people know, okay, in case you didn't check your news, not everyone does, you know, like not everyone likes to read the news. So for those people, hopefully this was brand new information. And for those of you that do read the news, I mean, at the very least, we can kind of share in this like hype together, right? So that's also, I think pretty valuable but anyways that is gonna be today's video guys that's all I really wanted to say um, I think I rambled a lot because I'm really tired so I'm sorry I apologize for that but look forward to it guys it's coming head-to-head -head confrontation with the all-out Goku my body might be might have gotten smaller but I still throw a mean punch okay if you say so we'll see um, but anyways guys, thank you so much for watching. As always, if you liked the video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.